Hey, you must be the new doctor. Mary Poppins, how do you do? Fine, thanks. Uh, sorry to be so short with you, but the ER can get stressful. You know, I'm not going to lie, we're stretched pretty thin. Yes, but in any job that must be done, there is an element of fun. Uh, yeah, whatever. Uh, glad you're here. Anyway, here is your patient list. Ah. Let me know if you need anything. Ta-da! Let's see what we have here. Oh. Uh, you are Mr. Thompson? Uh, yeah, uh, I think I swallowed a penny. Hmm, no, you don't look well at all. Have you been getting enough exercise? Not really. I'd recommend five minutes of step in time each morning. Is that like CrossFit? It's where you dance on the roof and click your heels all while sweeping a chimney. I live in a basement. Wonderful. Then you can just pretend. And I'd like you to stop eating coins and start taking these pills. And remember, a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. I'm diabetic. A spoonful of sugar will literally kill me. Ah, but if you don't take your medicine, I will have to tell your mother and father that you are a rather naughty little boy. I'm 46. Yes, you are. Uh, doctor, doctor, uh, we have a severe hand laceration, possible nerve injury. Oh, God, my hand! Uh, tell me, friend, whatever is the matter. A, a dog bit my hand, and then the cat got jealous, and then she bit it, too. We have to stop the bleeding. Give me 100 cc's of morphine drip and a tourniquet stat. Right away, but just remember, a tourniquet, a tourniquet. Doctor? will stop the blood, but better yet. This is serious. You'll quit your talk of cars and hounds. What's happening? When you turn your frown upside down. Wh what does that even mean? Just smile. Uh, like, like this? Wonderful. We're going to have to amputate. What? <laughs> Don't forget to smile. Let's get her into surgery. So long. Perhaps one last wave while you still can. Oh. Splendid. Oh, oh, doctor, oh, it's uh, Mrs. Pasternacki. Oh. Her vitals have crashed. I think we've lost her. No oh, nonsense. Let's see what we have here. No. Oh, that's nice. What is it, a B-flat? No, she's flat lining. Ah, I see. Well, you know what I always say when I'm feeling sad and confused and I don't know what to do. I have no idea. Feed the birds, toppins a bag, toppins, toppins, toppins a bag. How does that help? I don't quite know, but it's much more fun than thinking about death. Hurry, please. All right, let me see what I have here in my bag. A lamp, oh, some strawberry cordial, an umbrella, typical. Ah, yes, here it is. A defibrillator. All right, clear. Ah, here she comes. <coughs> <laughs> oh, it was so strange. I was moving toward a light, and then I heard someone singing about birds, and I knew I had to come back to find out what the hell a tuppence is. Well, that's for next time. The wind has changed. My work is done. Goodbye, children. What the? Uh, am I still in a coma, or did that lady fly out the window with her umbrella? <laughs> Goodbye, Mary Poppins. Thank you for everything. Ta -ta. Ah, she's not the best ER doctor, but she was perfectly, practically perfect in every other way. <laughs> How's our amputee doing? Ah, uh, she bled out on the table before we could amputate. Dang it! Yeah.